amenity prices have really affected game farming in the past two years, maybe three years, um, with the price of wheat going up last year. Fuel price has been going up year on year for the past three years, drastically, going from perhaps 90p in 07 a litre to now £1.30. These prices are making a huge impact on delivery costs. We've had bedding increases, so you've looked at different types of bedding. We've gone from using shavings to using cardboard, perhaps using rape straw. I know game farmers have bought um, chopping, straw chopping machines to chop straw to try and cut their bedding costs down. And fuel prices have, have hit the gas that we use. We've gone from using conventional heaters to using infrared heaters because they use less gas, they burn more efficiently. You spend more money developing these ideas, but I suppose over two, three, four years they were paid for themselves. We've been working for the past three years on the development of monochromatic lighting, which is the use of coloured lights in producing the birds. And this encourages the birds to mature quickly, they produce better muscle tone, and they molt a lot quicker. And we've seen a lot of benefits in using this in the past three years, and it's on a low wattage light system. So that keeps our electricity costs down. You know, innovations and new ways of working are good for everybody. And of course, if we can save labour costs, it's, it's better for us and less stress on the birds. And at the end of the day, we want to produce a quality pulp with as less stress in it as possible. There's no greater pleasure as a game farmer than turning up in November when you've been invited on a day shoot and everyone's saying how well those birds fly and how, how chuffed they are with the birds and what a good season they're having. That really fulfills you with a great sense of satisfaction.